Today we will do a full teardown of our fat Xbox 360. For this you will need an Xbox 360 disassembly tool and a T10 and T8 Torx screwdriver. Press this button to remove your hard drive. Pinch the faceplate here and pull it off. The side grills have six tabs each. You want to press them with a small object and gently pry them away. The best top right grill holes are marked here. Bottom right are here. Only four of the tabs on the left are easily accessible. The top two best holes are here. The bottom two are here. Gently wiggle the last two tabs free. Align the disassembly tool with these two holes and pry this side of the back apart. Do the same with these five holes. Gently pry these four tabs open and remove the bottom. Remove all 23 screws here while noting their sizes. Set them aside for safekeeping. Gently pull the eject button and remove the top shell. Carefully pull the DVD drive out, then remove the cables. Pull the fan shroud out by sticking a flat tool here then pulling it. Then remove and gently unplug the fan. Remove this piece and the three screws. Note that they are the same size as the eight on the bottom and put them aside. Remove the control board. Carefully remove the motherboard. I prefer to pull the memory card slots. Do not pull by the heat sinks. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed this episode of the Wilson Minute. If you did, make sure to like, subscribe, comment, and if applicable, watch the next and previous videos in this series. If you would like to help support this channel, I have listed ways to do so in the video's description. Do the do!